I used to work for airlines in their pricing department. Hundreds of analysts, managers and strategists debated commercial strategies, route planning and flight scheduling. From ticket prices to the economics of airplanes, we discussed a lot of things there. But one figure we rarely debated, airplane safety. Not only because this was not our field, there are entire areas dedicated to that, but also because to travel by airplane is safe. Very safe. It's more likely that a person dies struck by a lightning or falls from bad during sleep than in an airplane crash. And even this minor danger is not evenly spread. There are safe, very safe and incredibly safe planes. And in this article I'll tell you which is the safest to fly. But before everything I want to tell you that by no means I'm saying that any of the companies mentioned make bad planes. Even the worst of the six names listed is safe enough that you should worry about food poisoning at an airport bar more than an airline catastrophe. And since I already mentioned that we rank six different aircraft makers according to safety, here is the list of them. However, before we begin I would like to ask a small favor. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like and subscribe button so that YouTube can continue to show it to others. So these are the airplane manufacturers analyzing. With data, from the Aviation Safety Network, ANS, a private initiative started in 1996. Some of that is also from the page turbly.com, we included the statistics from the six makers, which are Airbus, the second largest manufacturer of commercial airplanes in the world. It's owned by the European Aeronautics Defense and Space Company, EADS, from Germany, France, Spain, with an 80% stake, and buy systems from the United Kingdom with a 20% share. Its first product, the A300, was put in service in 1974. Boeing, created in the USA, is the world's biggest aerospace company. Uh, it was founded by William E. Boeing, that started in 1916 as an aero product company, and then in the late 20s it became part of the United Craft and Transportation Corporation. The first American jetliner was the Boeing 707. Embraer, a multinational company based in Brazil, making planes for commercial, executive defense and agricultural use. The company has made over 8,000 planes since 1969. Then Bombardier, a Canadian company that makes planes, rail transportation equipment and motorized consumer products, including jet skis. And during the 80s, they also entered the aerospace business. ATR, Avionics de Transport Regional, or Aere de Transporto Regionale, is a joint venture between France and Italy, it started in 1981. Its major products are the ATR-42 and the ATR-72 planes. Sukhoi, a Russian holding manufacturing both civilian and military aircraft. And the company is the biggest exporter of Russian planes in the world. So time to go to the numbers and decide the safest aircraft manufacturer. When comparing the various manufacturers, the Brazilian based Embraer comes out on top with only 0.01 fatal incidents per thousand years of service duration. Compared to Embraer, the Franco Italian company ATR has a risk that is 50 times higher, while Sukhoi has 90 times the risk of the Brazilian maker, making them both the least safe in our study. The difference between Airbus, Boeing and Bombardier are minor, all of them being more dangerous than Embraer, but far safer than ATR or Sukhoi. The victory of Embraer in this research may be quite surprising. It's a common belief that larger jets should be safer than smaller planes, therefore most would expect Boeing and Airbus to leave the ranking, while ATR, Sukhoi and Embraer should take the last spots. But that's not what happened. Independent of the reason, the Brazilian manufacturer, despite fabricating smaller jets, managed to make them safer than the larger machines from both Boeing and Airbus. Something that the engineers from the ITA, Institut Tecnologico de Aeronáutica, the military institution that supplies many of Embraer's technicians, should be proud about. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Remember to subscribe to our channel for the next ones.